Today I will show you how you can make Arduino robot arm, sponsored by PCBWay Prototype PCB Manufacturer. For building this awesome learning robot, you will need 4 micro servo motors and wooden popsicles. For base, I am using this wooden block and first servo must be glued upside down. On this servo, we attach the shoulder that we made from wooden popsicles and on that... left.
Oh, okay. Need auto. Auto is smart, interactive, homemade robot with a lot of functions and you can play with him with hours. It's made from 3D printed parts, Arduino board and a lot of Arduino modules, such ultrasonic sensor, 4 micro servo motors, 8x8 LED matrix, inside there is a Bluetooth module, a buzzer, LiPo battery with charger model and all models are placed in his body. I can control Otto with my smartphone because Otto has Bluetooth module and it's connected with the phone. This app has a lot of functions. Let's see some movements. are all for ultrasonic distance sensor which is not included in the kit or any I2C device. The brains of the robot is going to be the microbit board which goes in this slot. In addition to the features of the robot kit, the microbit board offers Bluetooth, a temperature sensor, a compass, an accelerometer, two buttons and an LED matrix. Amazing stuff! We can build some amazing robot behaviors with all the sensors that are it works. I can control the robot using some of the buttons on it. Of course, since this is an IR remote control, we have to point the controller directly at the receiver in order to work. But still, this is very impressive. We can achieve all this using block commands on a web interface. If you use your imagination and the sensors and the features the microbit board offers, you can develop impressive robot behaviors. I would love to see what you are going to build with it. To sum up, I think this is the best robot to buy if you are a beginner. It is inexpensive and it is very easy and fun to program. If you are a beginner in robotics or a beginner in programming in general, this is the best way to start your journey in programming. You are going to learn a lot of things easily and then you can move on to our